There are a few reasons why this program will help. Firstly, adults didn't put enough efforts and attention on the awareness of instilling the environmental care in primary school students. Kids nowadays should be taught the importance and good effects of taking care of the environment from entry primary school so that the attitude of keeping their surrounding clean can be instilled and practices all their life. The earlier they learn about this, they will be more serious regarding this matter when they are growing up. Secondly, students at SK Panang Jawa will lack of program exposure and attention from foreign organization regarding science related program. According to the teachers at the school, less program from non-profitable organization were held at their school. This will affect the excitement of the students towards learning in classes because there is less periodic and joyful program will help. And lastly, UITM students, which is the program organizer, ability to conduct program and handling large capacity of the students of SK Padang Jawa. This program was set to involve all students from preschool, grade 1 until grade 6. The program will be an interesting challenge for UITM students on becoming facilitator on the day of the event, handling various behaviors of students at SK Padang Jawa. There are three main objectives of this program. Firstly, to educate primary school students about the importance of sustaining the good quality care of environment for future planning and generations. Secondly, to expose the students with various science experiments and shows along with competition to increase their interest, creativity and innovativity towards learning and exploring science field. And lastly, is to enhance and stimulate the hidden skills of UITM students on organizing programs while breaking their barrier in communication with people from multiple stages of age and positions during the program. We met with the headmaster of Sekolah Kebangsaan Padang Jawa to propose a plan to implement this project to him. He supported our project and he is honored when we are willing to come here and provide a program that is beneficial to his students, especially the science and environment programs. This project is related to Service Learning Malaysia, a university for society Sulam, whereby we serve and interact with the community, especially the students and staff of Sekolah Kebangsaan Padang Jawa. This project also related to 12th goal of sustainable development goals, responsible consumption and production. Sustainable consumption and production is about doing more and better with less. It is also about decoupling academic growth from environmental degradation, increasing resource efficiency, and also uh, promoting sustainable lifestyle. We held a talk on the importance of caring for the environment for students. This is the first meeting of our group. The objective is to brainstorm the idea on how to do the program. These are the moments where we negotiate with all sides that contribute to the program. We will present to you guys about our program feedback from the participants after the program has finished. We use Google Form as a medium to collect surveys from the participant. As you can see, we have 37 respondents in total. Most of the respondent is students which consists of 86.6%. Followed by the committee by 16.1% and 3.2% of teachers. The slides display the average votes for by the participants on the content of program, multimedia showcase, location of program, and overall qualities uh, of activities run by our program. As you can see, most of the participants votes for five for all the segments which is the best outcome.
and while only a certain number of participants vote for number four. This shows that our program have its particular values and the participants is happy for it. Uh, for a question, the, do you agree that this program teach you soft skill? We can see all of the participants vote for agreed to the questions. This shows that uh, our own, our program not only have valuable contents in them, but it teach soft skills to the participants without concerning the age. The next slide shows some of the comments of uh, the respondents to our programs. One of them says that our program teach them uh, the awareness of sustainability and how to relate science and creativity. They're also glad that uh, we organize our program at their school and it is really an enjoyable day of event. By completing this project, we have achieved a lot of essential experience as a student in charge in handling these big tasks. For example, from the teamwork skill, where each of the children have given responsibilities, we are able to collaborate with each other to complete our tasks. And there are a lot of several departments that are formed where every department receives a different task and are given to the student to be completed. The student also need to be disciplined and sensitive and we are aware to the important date to complete our task. And then we are able to learn to planning program where we need to do paperwork and there are also, uh, we also have to take consideration of our resources when doing our program. Next, I have, we gain a lot of benefit through the improvement of our communication skill and we can also boost uh, our confidence through the interaction with the student and the teachers through the program and through the science program also we are able to interact more with the student that we never have done in UITM. Next, uh, we are able to enhance our critical thinking through a meeting where we are able to sharing ideas within the group member. And we are also able to learn to be more proactive in doing our work. And the progression of our work uh, is also benefit to our growth as we are able to become more mature through the problem that we have had faced. Where every detail of the task need to be considered so that our program can move uh, smoothly. In conclusion, our program had finished successfully and the objective of the activities, objective of SULAM and the objective of sustainable development goals had been achieved. We really appreciate all kind of help from all sources and organization, including lecturers, teachers, committee and participants for making our program a huge success. We hope that this is not the end and hoping to work again together in the further future.